welcome to my channel today i am here uh, with another simple stylish pretty summer dress and i divided this video into three parts for all my lovely subscribers who want to follow step by step so in this first part i will be covering the uh, cutting and uh, attaching of pockets and uh, uh, please subscribe my channel and press bell icon so you can get future video notifications so let's get started i designed this dress for today's video in this dress i'm going to add side pockets and this is a fit and flat dress cold shoulders ruffle around cold shoulders and if i've got left with fabric so i will add some ruffle around the uh, skirt base as well i'm going to add side zip as well these are two darts i'm going to add front and back from base toward upside so you need to take your measurement and i'm going to use at least three meter of fabric you need and i'm going to use bias binding you need measuring tape uh, scissor invisible zip small is, uh, is a 12 inches invisible zip i'm going to use and uh, how to cut the skirt i have described in many videos but i'm going to cut quickly uh, for you again make a square piece of fabric and then fold it again and take the wa uh, waist measurement from the one side take your waist measurement and this is a rest of your skirt and give a shape according to the length of uh, length you want so it's slightly curved and it's going like that so when your skirt will open it will look like this so i'm going to add pockets around this area so let's get started I have cut front and back bodies part and how to cut the bodies I will add the link below um, bodies are uh, it is a upper part of this skirt and uh, I took my measurement of 16 inches you can take your measurement but it is uh, good to take a little bit extra so I added one inches extra so after stitching my bodies will be 15 inches ready and uh, skirt I took 25 inches because I want my dress up to 40 inches so this bodice is will be 15 inches ready and now I will start by making pockets first I have separated a front and back part of the skirt so now uh, it's better to pin them up at the same time I have pinned them up so the fabric will be staying intact now center of the fabric mark with the scissors small cut so in this way you will remember where to match and the same the center of the front fabric fold it and then make a small cut so you can easily match the front um, uh, body part with the skirt so we have cut on here as well and now what I'm going to do from the center fold I'm going to take six inches because 
my waist measurement is um, 15 inches total from the front so I want my pockets in front so I'm taking 6 inches from 6 inches I'm going to curve this fabric or if you want you can mark it or make a shape so I'm going to from 6 inches I'm going to curve only the front part of the skirt not the back so from 6 so when I will be open it will be 12 inches or uh, even we can make a little bit smaller 5.5 so let's start you can make any shape for your pockets it just for giving a style so like this so this is a shape I gave for the pocket so now we have a measurement and for the pocket I will be using this fabric piece of fabric as a template and I will be the cut I will cutting the extra fabric for the pocket underneath so these uh, are our two templates this is for right uh, hand and this is for the left hand keep right on the right side and keep um, fold the extra fabric and make sure this extra fabric is definitely bigger than the fabric you're going to use so keep your pocket as you're going to attach on this fabric and then this is a cut end so make sure you leave your leave space for your hand so we need a little bit extra fabric so it's coming like this your hand and it's diagonal or you can just cut as a V shape so I'm going according to my hand I'm going to give a shape so template is there so I can use it you can use this fabric as well or if you want to use plain fabric it's totally up to you and this is a side because this is a skirt dress and it will cut like this and you can leave it like this this pocket it will be a little bit extra or uh, extra piece it's coming like this you can cut so you can see my hand can fit in so this one I have removed so I have a template for one side so this part this is a skirt part from where I cut this part now you can see this is a, a skirt end and what I'm going to do I'm going to attach this one on this right side like this first stretch this side and then there will be a pocket on this side so before doing that I'm going to add uh, this uh, bias binding around so you can clearly see what is added this bias binding around this pocket area and this one is my piece for the pocket I cut you can uh, um, uh, zigzag this piece so you're going to place this one underneath front side facing each other place it like this and use your pins to fix it so you know where you're going to stretch all around and now you have to uh, turn this fabric over and then stitch the same color of fabric so you cannot see like this so I will stitch it and I will come back and I will show you and on the same on another side as well same way take another piece of uh, uh, fabric you cut this one my piece and then I will be doing the same on this side as well fix it and then 